Hey guys, I'm gonna do something a little bit different today. I wanna do, first thing I do is crack my knuckles. I'll just leave that in, who cares? I have the ability to show you my yard back in 2019 and show you the transitions from 2019 all the way up to 2021. So that's what I'm gonna do in this clip. You can see when you start out with a bad yard in January, February, you can see what happens when you put down your pre-emergent the year before, and how it's fighting off the POA, the broadleaf weeds, and then how you start your transition into the Scott's annual plan or your Lesco plan or your ACE hardware plan. And then it shows how when you start your fertilizer, how things start to transition and the extra things you add, maybe you're doing a spray fertilizer like I've shown in some, some of my videos. So these clips that you're seeing going by are the work that I did and I remembered to take a photo of the yard that day at a certain time every day for the, for two years. So yes, I was bored, but I remembered to do it, set a reminder on my phone. And everything I've done, I've recorded on my phone notes so I can go back and refer to something and say, dang, it was green that month. What did I do? Let's just go through these and see how they do. I had a nice green yard so I can go back to my notes and say, what was I using then? transitioning to June. You can actually start seeing a neighbor's house being built in the distance, which is pretty cool. It's a good way to remember what worked, what didn't, and what you need to try to do following the next year. Maybe you missed a step the year prior and you can make up for it. You can see how the POA is less and less each year because of the pre-emergence I'm putting out here. I have a new camera angle. But look how pretty it is. That's about it guys. Hope everybody's doing well. I hope you get your lawn fixed up if it's not already.